<laughs> Hello, I am the Ronin Pawn, and this is a video about copyright claims. About a copyright claim I've received against a specific video. I made a parody of Drake's Hotline Bling released on this very channel. Click wherever it is on screen I've put it to go and see it. And immediately it was claimed automatically by YouTube's system on behalf of Universal Music Group, UMG, Universal, as in Universal Studios, as in the big guys. And I had to fight that claim for 60 days. We went back and forth, two different bouts of fisticuffs, and in the end, UMG walked away because I was right and they were wrong. I have the right to use Drake's music the way that I used it in that video under parody and fair use law. But today, I woke up to find that there were six new combatants come to my battlefield. Welcome, fellas. Welcome to the fight for intellectual property on YouTube. You've picked the wrong enemy. This was not an automated strike. This was an individual who came online, found the video, clicked on it, and used their tools that they've been given by YouTube in order to monetize it for themselves. UMG, when the strike was automatically filed against me, they just took it down. They said, you can't distribute this anywhere because it's got our content in it. And that was an automated system. This is not an automated system. This is an individual who came onto my video and clicked the I want his money button. And for a moment, they got to have whatever money they could get off of it. But that brief moment only lasted until I wrote the letter that I'm about to read to you in dispute of their claim against me. Right now, my MCN, Blindly Imaginative Networks, is working hard to make sure that they lose, as they are destined to. And I wanted to share with you my reply to these six separate entities who claim my work is theirs. I have already spent 60 days tied up in copyright claimsville on this video with Universal Music Group, the parent company of the label under which the musical artist Drake does business. And I won that claim on the grounds of parody and fair use. UMG can never bring issue against this work again within YouTube systems. It has been found that I have the right to use this media as I have in this video under fair use and parody law. Now, here we have a pack of jackals come to steal more of my time and potential revenue. Let me ask, how many claims are allowed to be brought against a single video containing a single piece of musical media in the course of its life? Do all of these entities own the copyright? In addition to UMG, who has already lost their claim against it? And must I defend it but over and again each time some new musical distributor gets a term-limited contract to try and sling CDs on a street corner somewhere? None of the parties listed as claimants here have a standing to bring issue. A music redistributor in Israel, I'm looking at you, W-A-M-I, does not get to claim this as their work. Why? Because it isn't. Complicated, I know. None of you hold rights to the music you've claimed here, and further, you sure as hellfire don't own any of the rights to my performance, comedic delivery, remix, edit, videography, special effects, or the visuals I created in my video. I know you don't own them because I own them. And by claiming this video, you have stolen my intellectual property. Far as I can tell, EMI has absolutely no affiliation with the artist Drake. So even in the best case scenario, were any of you correct in claiming that I don't have the right to monetize this content because I'm not the rights holder, which you aren't, as YouTube has already determined, see UMG. Well, neither are any of you. Since I have simultaneously received claims from Zakes CS, Stim CS, Compass CS, Whammy CS, PRS CS, and EMI Music Publishing, I demand that these six separate agencies all claiming the right to administer the works of Drake, in addition to Universal Music Group, who I've already dispatched, submit here a list of the percentage shares of the musical work Hotline Bling they each hold. None of you can have 100% of it, or else all the rest of you don't have a right to bring suit. So, how exactly are the seven of you, including UMG, who is the only one here with a clear right to bring issue and who has already lost that claim, all rightful copyright holders entitled to bring action? And oh yeah, with the seven of you splitting this authority, does the actual artist Drake or his label Cash Money Records still own any of the rights to the song he wrote, recorded, and performed? 
because that would make nine of you who claim authority to administer this work, and who each proclaim themselves the rightful recipients of any and all income generated by it. No, you're just a bunch of petty thieves, middlemen who don't do anything for a living but suck at the tit of artists and creators who do, and you will lose, and I will win, just as I won against Universal Music Group. Because you are a bunch of slimy, scumbag liars cheating and manipulating any system within your eyesight so you can steal a quick buck that you didn't earn from someone else who has sweat and bled to earn it. I'm an artist who built upon another artist's work to create a joyful experience of amusement and laughter for others. You are pickpockets. You didn't work, you didn't edit, you didn't compose or record, you didn't have an idea or bring it to term by the persistent effort of your own labors. You just walked up after the fact and stuck your hand down my pants in search of my wallet. Well, since you're down there, feel free to suck this. YouTube's copyright system is changing. Claims like these are going into escrow from now on, and the revenues you've been illegitimately snaking off the top will be coming back to the artists who you never had a right to go after when you lose. So get your last jabs in, boys, because this is round 13, and the next bell you hear will mean KO for you sleazy fucking shit stains. And P.S. Thanks for giving me a little something extra to make a video about today. You have a better claim to money off of this one than you do off of my parody of Drake's Hotline Bling. Fuck off and die.